look shiny. <sighs> Jesus is a love song. Are y'all ready for the Clark Sisters? I am ready for the Clark Sisters biopic on Lifetime. Is it going to be on Lifetime? They better do them right. The fact that Queen Latifah, Mary J. Blige, Missy Elegant are in on it, I'm okay. My spirit, it, it feels good. It ain't going to be like that Aaliyah crap we saw. I need to do my makeup because <clears throat> we're going to church. Oh, yeah, I'm tired. Um, I am putting on baby skin Maybelline instant pore eraser just a little bit just a touch a little okay you gonna went from <laughs> sanctified to uh, the lake of fire <laughs> yeah y'all know I'm silly okay we're gonna be getting ready I don't know what's going on with the light back here but y'all know I, I can never get my my lights ah there we go there we go Using a little bit of concealer by, well, who is this? Girl, I don't even know. I think this is LA Colors. I don't know. Just on the dark spots. So what's been going on, girl? What has been going on? Y'all, uh, we got two more days left till these kids go back to school. I am so ready. We had a wonderful time off, but when I tell you I am done, put a fork in me. Temperature inside reading is reading 140 degrees. We ready. Child, I am so ready for this boy to go back to school. I almost, <laughs> I almost contacted his teacher and be like, are you, are you ready? Like I'm ready. Are you ready for these kids? Cause I'm ready girl. Um, y'all and i just have one but he is like and he ain't ready to go back oh well so i was supposed to be back here looking at shari j's video while getting ready she did a everyone around this time is doing a video it's, it's funny like the most common videos i'm seeing right now is what's coming up for 2020 what they expect from me uh worst products from 2019 what i'm ditching in 2019 you know those type of videos are very common girl not me you ain't seen nothing i mean you see my video i posted in early december it only got 300 clicks so i'm gonna go ahead and uh link that video in here my goals or what to what to expect on my channel for 2020 because some of y'all gonna be lost some of y'all gonna be confused quite frankly but yeah that's what we're gonna do now whoo how these eyes are looking girl jumbo milk pencil by nyx as my primer i have legit eyelid primers but we don't care to use that i, I ain't got time um yeah, so I've been looking at, you know, catching up on those videos. Now, I ain't, uh, she told me not to be saying her name. Well, she didn't tell me that. She's like, girl, you be saying my real name in the videos. Yes, I do. I can't see. Hold on. Yes, I do, sis. <laughs> Nezzy Naps did a video of her top 10 favorite hair products and top 10 eyeshadow palettes. Girl, when she said that one. I almost choked, girl, when you said that one makeup palette was $129, $149. I would never never maybe want to get my tax refund a hundred the most expensive i have the uh, well i would say the most expensive eyeshadow palette that i have ever purchased and you do see a difference i will say that um bobby brown four little raggedy ass vivian four little you know eyeshadow palettes 45 50 dollars and that was on sale but when I tell you that stuff lasts me for a long time and the pigmentation you pay for what you get yeah, there are some $3 for that yang yang little eyeshadows that I can make pop, but you gotta work for it. Will you spend that much money on a eyeshadow palette? It isn't, and I'm gonna tell you, girl, those eyeshadow palettes, I, they were beautiful that she was showing. Yeah, my thing is um, eyeshadows. I love eyeshadows. I easily have 60 to 70. So y'all watching those, it's supposed to be watching. I may have to go on mute. <sighs> Girl, so what have y'all been watching on TV? I haven't been watching Peppa the Pig. <laughs> Shit. When I tell you I'm ready for this boy to go to school, um, 
hold on y'all let me get my eyeshadow palettes i'm going to be going in between this revolution reloaded that i got from ulta last year or this year actually and the morph which number is this 3502 she bad she's bad look at that she's bad i've been all up in this one so i've been trying to look at some stuff on netflix i finally watched this morning um I O. it was a movie I O. end of the world stuff the earth is dying we need oxygen just to walk around in certain parts oh yeah i know man i love those type of movies everyone's dying literally there's like two two or three people left on the earth everyone else went out onto some colony orbiting outside of earth and they're trying to make you know earth have uh, have habitual you know livable you know what i mean so i saw that it was okay uh it was okay um i did finish watching the good place i've been binge watch all of that um girl i saw one sometimes y'all what i like to do i know most people do you just watch the trailer right and then let you know whether or not you wanted to watch it sweetheart when i tell you that trailer was everything i was like jb and i watched that movie immediately i'm like jb we gotta watch it because i need to know what the hell was that thing and, and that stood up and, and saw her so um yeah that was a cute little scary movie that i saw i think i'm gonna binge watch frankie and johnny well it is called frankie and frankie and basically john found and the other old lady <laughs> my mama told me it was really good i know a couple of you guys said it was good yeah i need to watch the time what time is it girl you got 10 minutes to do your i did see the preview for uh the messiah blasphemy Y'all know me. I'm like, what, what, what? So yeah, I can't really get much into anything. Work has been steadily busy. We were busy over the break. I was like, if y'all don't stop emailing in. Ooh, I should have never did that. What's on this brush? See, I need to clean my brushes. Yeah, it was steady, steady, busy. And I was working by myself again because Christine took off as she should. And we have a good working relationship. So stuff that came in that I couldn't answer, she was able to help me. Do y'all see what I'm doing? Yeah, I'm making a mess. <laughs> Chocolate cap corn. I know you want to be messy. And this is the thing. At the end of the day, I don't care what someone does to their hair. It's their hair, their body, their coins, whatever. But this is this is how I, I kind of side eye. And what I'm referring to are the women that have been natural for a number of years and their channel is centered around natural hair, beauty, ex, beauty, etc. And then they decide, I relax my hair after four months or four years or two years or whatever, how long of being natural. Someone who recently did it is I Love Megs. Now Megs had beautiful hair while she was relaxed and she was kind of struggling while she went when she transitioned to be to be a natural honestly i'm not surprised that she went back to relax her because her entire energy when she was doing her hair in my opinion was off um y'all it takes patience for your natural hair but at the end of the day like i say you can do whatever you want i also found that some people just be doing too much all you need to do is cleanse your hair. Make sure your scalp is cleansed, moisturized, low maintenance styling, length retention. Your expectations, look, you can't go on typing and twist out. You're going to see a banging ass twist out because that's what we choose to show you. Look, this is me. Like, seriously, this is this is what I be looking like uh, going to Albertsons, going to go take my, this is what people see. You know, y'all. I'm about to do, you know, take it down. You're gonna see, but and sometimes I look down in the comment section, and I can only stay in that comment section a little too long because I'll, I'll be about to respond to people, and I don't want to put that type of energy on her or whoever's channel, not necessarily her video or her channel. I'll see comments like, "Yo, girl, my natural hair was just too much work," or "Girl, I just couldn't find the products, and my hair just kept breaking off." Um, there are so many products out there. That's a blessing and it can be a curse at the same time. But there's really, in my opinion, unless there's something going on with you medically, there's no reason why you can't properly moisturize your hair. There are so many products. Look, look over here. Look, look, look. You see that over there? There are so many products for our hair, for four type hair. But again, some of us are just doing too much. We have false expectations. Leave your hair alone. You can't rock a bang and twist out all the time. 
I'm kicking. And also bear in mind, the reason why my hair be looking fabulous a lot of the times is because I leave my hair alone. One, two, my environment. I don't have to fight with humidity. It's dry here in Phoenix. I ain't got to fight with Texas heat, Florida. Oh God, girl, if you live in Florida, if you live in the islands, if you live in Louisiana, your hair gonna puff out. So all, you have to take all of that into consideration. Um, so yeah, she could do whatever she wants with her hair. And what I also find interesting, there was another young lady who just hoarded my comments because her video got a ridiculous amount of thumbs down. I never, I rarely thumbs down video, but her video has so many thumbs down just because she chose to relax her hair. And what's so funny is that I think she's already gone back to, I think she big chopped again. So it's very common for women who go back to relax to go back to natural. Um, and everyone has personal reasons. For me personally, it's health wise. <sighs> Girl, good luck. I'll be, I'm still subscribed to her. You know, I'm pretty sure people, girl, people get up and they feel us when they see that relaxer come out. <laughs> um, She could do whatever she wants. Her hair. Yeah, let me turn this camera off and finish my makeup. Ryan Little. <laughs> Low bun is where it's at. Look, I ain't got time for y'all. Y'all making me late for uh, church as it is. And um, I'm gonna do some bobby pins on the side of my hair. Baby, I am serving you Norma Bates, mama. We getting it in. Um, it is what it is. Low classy bun. I told y'all I'm not doing much with my hair 2020. Y'all thought I was lying. I am not here for the extraness. I'm here for the leave my hair alone, let it grow. That's it. Let me put on these stockings. Yeah, I still wear stockings to church. Yeah, I got these dress, this dress from, um, it's a little big, cause I like my stuff to be, yeah, girl, but we're going to church, you don't need to be that way. <laughs> Goodwill, $10, ain't that cute? All right, y'all.